Hey guys, this is sort of an update video to my KH3 no attack run. After someone commented that beating Xehanort in rage mode is possible, so please check out the original video if you want to see if we can beat the entire game without attacking. If you only want to see the gameplay of me beating Xehanort in rage form without attacking, you can skip to this point in the video. Otherwise, I'm just going to talk you all through the steps that I took to beat Xehanort in rage form. Go ahead, I'll wait. Thanks for wanting to hear my voice. Please keep in mind that none of these steps are absolutely crucial to beating Xehanort without attacking. I just wanted to stack everything in my favor for the fight since I didn't know that it was possible. So the first thing that you want to do is buy food from the Moogle shop. It's very easy to do and by this point in the game, you'll have enough money that you can waste it on food. This is the meal that I ended up eating but it's absolutely not necessary to eat exactly what I use. Just eat something to boost your stats. Next up is the equipment. Here is what I have for Donald and Goofy. I don't think the abilities matter either, but in case you guys were wondering, here they are. Lastly, and I think this is the most important one, if you go to the customize section of the pause screen, you can change Donald and Goofy's AI. Instead of stick with Sora, change it to finish the job. We need them to be aggressive. And that's all the setup that I did. All of this isn't necessary, but I wanted to stack everything in my favor. What makes this challenge possible is the fact that the arrows that appear above the command menu don't disappear. If they did, then this challenge would be impossible. This will be the last time that you hear my voice. See you all in the next video.
shine.